Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Ocasio Cortez might be in even bigger trouble for her lies about boyfriend. Millennial socialist Alexandria Ocasio Cortez Stalin (DNY) could be in even bigger trouble than Jesse Smollett, who was just arrested by Chicago police for his fake hate crime. Yesterday, it was reported by multiple media outlets that Oc helped funnel $6,000 to her boyfriend during her campaign. Today, we've learned those contributions were likely illegal. And if not downright criminal, at the very least highly unethical. From Twitchy. Remember Luke Thompson? He's the guy we told you about last week whose account was locked by Twitter after he started asking questions about why Rep. Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez's boyfriend has an official House email account. The MSM blew Thompson off, as did Ock's chief of staff, Saika Chakra. But Thompson, not satisfied with the excuses offered up by Ock's office, kept digging and found that a liberal super PAC paid Ock's boyfriend $6,000 during the campaign at a time when the campaign was deeply in debt. Oh, and the payments are possibly illegal. All of this could be illegal. Even if it's not illegal, it does raise ethical issues. As we reported yesterday. Days ago Ocasio-Cortez was called out for giving her boyfriend a paying job on her staff. She and her chief of staff feigned outrage and said that he was not being paid. They claimed he only had a congressional email to check on her calendar for her and that it was common practice. And they were, in part, telling the truth but not in the way that normal people tell the truth. She and her chief of staff had found a much more clever way of paying her boyfriend that would not be caught as quickly. A rich guy used a pack to pay Ock's boyfriend $6,000 when her campaign was running out of money. After Ock won, she gave that rich guy a job in her office. Follow me on a journey, author Luke Thompson said. Last week, at Ock and her chief of staff at Psychotic, the rich guy in question, freaked out on me when I pointed out it looked like she'd hired her boyfriend. I did some digging in the feck. Turns out Psychot has hired her boyfriend, before, just not to do any actual work, he said. Dotadoc paid brand new Congress LLC, which at Psychot Cones, for strategic consulting. At brand new 535, the PAC Psychot ran in parallel to his LLC, turned around and paid Riley Roberts, the boyfriend, the same amount as its sole marketing consultant. How swampy, he said. The payments to Roberts are the largest payments made by at brand new 535 to any person or group other than brand new Congress LLC. Oh, and Roberts doesn't work in marketing, Thompson said. What do you think of this? That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.